Snake Snake's back in the house. Yeah, I'm back in the house. This is Ubuntu. Yeah, Ubuntu. 1610. Yakety yak. Don't come back. Okay. Right. This may surprise you, but I have not used default Ubuntu for one, two, three, five years or more. Okay. I normally stick with Ubuntu or an XFC based distro. So I'm relearning. I basically remember what was going on before. Now you can get the Unity 8 developer preview on this as well, but this isn't, okay? Because I'm just showing you what's going down. I'm not going to go into a fully in-depth review because most of you know what it is. There's lots of little bits and bobs that have gone on, like the snap packages and stuff like that, the more available, etc. But I've just installed it to show you what it's all about. And I must admit, it has not come on in leaps and bounds since the last time I used it, okay? The last real time. It's not laggy, it's not slow, it hasn't crashed on me or anything like that, so it's pretty good. Anyway, moving on, okay. you still got the Amazon thing here. Don't know that. Your system settings. Let's have a look. Mm. It's the usual. What else would it be? But as you can see, it is really nice and quick. I really did like that. I really did. What I have installed is this thing called Variety. Basically, it changes your desktop backgrounds, etc. Every five minutes, it says here. Whether it works. Who knows? I'll find out in a minute. But yeah, it has changed my desktop, so yeah. Why not? Carry on. That's my main thing. Firefox is your default browser of choice here. So it's the same one as you would always see. Nothing new there, is there really? No. If I go to Ubuntu 16.10, have a look. There's the release notes here. Bloody, 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 bloody. You can read it all yourself, but as it says here, the preview of the Unity 8 desktop included here. Snap 2.16. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And there's lots of lovely bits and bobs if you go down. About other stuff, okay? But you can go and do it yourself because you know how to read. I don't have to read for you, do I? No. Okay, you get full LibreOffice suite, so we'll open it up and see what it's like. It should be pretty nippy and fast. Yeah, that's what I mean. That's what it says on the tin, okay? Nice. I like it. But one of the main things I do like about it, okay, is this. Okay, the new software center. Did you see how fast that came up? Did you really? Every time I've used it before, and if, even in uh, Zubuntu, in the last version of Zubuntu, you had the old Ubuntu software center, and you click it, and wait, and wait, and wait, and nothing would happen, okay? But this seems really quick and snappy. Oh, it's one update, we'll do that in a minute. So if I click on Warzone 2100, which I do like this game, you should go and get it, because it's super duper. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You see how quick it was to go from page to page? Beforehand, it just wasn't happening, was it? No. No, it wasn't at all. No. Okay. I have um, now that I did all the updates while I was installing, okay. Oh, so that variety does work. We have changed the desktop wallpaper. Good. I've also installed Bingus. Yay! Just to make sure it all worked in such a new distro, really. Remember, Pingus has been going for donkeys of hells of years. Yeah, I know. I know, I know. As usual, you've got your super key. Just click up there for whatever you want to search for. So, say you want to search for Terminal, for instance. There you go. Anything with TE in it will bring up, which is nice. But it's also a lot, lot quicker. We'll click on the Sudoku. Click on to Easy. Oh, yeah. But see how nice and quick and snappy it is? I'm quite impressed. I must be honest with you. I wasn't expecting it to be like this. I was expecting the long, old, clanky, slow things of old. You know, I know. But it just didn't happen, did it? No. Shall we see some videos work? So if we go to the tube and find out, shall we? Yeah. See how quick that cuts out? See, it comes up quick. I'm really impressed, I must admit. After putting up with it being such a pain up the back side for so long, yeah, I'm, I'm liking that. So what we'll do, we'll just make sure we can run a video, shall we? So if we go to me... Wait one thing. Oh, I can't even spell my own name. My God. That's better. Here I am. Okay, we'll just quickly click on that one I've done the other day. Make sure it plays. It plays perfectly well. I can't be complain. I mean, you know, yeah. I like, can you see my voice? How surprised I really am. I really am surprised. Anyway, moving on. We'll go back up here. And we go here. <clears throat> We've got it. Recently used. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, appearance. I've got backups. Bluetooth. Additional drivers. We'll go down. Chromium bookmarks. Didn't even know Chromium was on here. No, I didn't know. Under music. Nothing there. Because I've not got anyone. Other pictures. 
nothing there because there's nothing on. The videos, nothing there because there's nothing on. Go back there, nothing there because there's nothing on. Well, what more can I say really? It looks really nice and it is really, really quick. But I'm not going to show you too much more really because Ubuntu is Ubuntu at the end of the day. Installation was a breeze, I must admit, it wasn't slow at all. And it's just nice to use. So I may consider it next time around it comes as an LTS. As you did said, I may consider. But nothing too much. No, not at all. So we'll do. Let's have the BBC renders on it in this version. Okay. Just have a quick look. But sometimes it doesn't render very well in all browsers. Okay. But yeah, that comes up nice. No lagginess or nothing. Impressed. I is. My god in Himmel. Who would have thought it? Me liking the Ubuntu. Mmm. But what can I say? What I will do, I will try the uh, preview of Unity 8 and see what goes down. But there's not much else to show you really because it's... That's it. It's Ubuntu. I like it. Very good. Sneaky Linux out. That's the way.